Guys, <laughs> we haven't been here for about a month because we were interstate and then quarantine. But um, if you remember, before we left, we had actually been harassing Money Ryan, uh, the person who runs this whole operation, our boss, for toilet paper because we went about three weeks without any toilet paper mm. in the men's bathroom. That ran out first. Then we resorted to the women's bathroom. We used all of that. We even went to the dis disabled bathroom, which I found out Keelan was using since day one. <laughs> As we all know, he hates the disabled. Uh, but even the toilet paper ran out there. We got down to using uh, dry hand paper bench towels. Paper Low-quality paper towel. Yeah, terrible mm. stuff. And then there was just fucking nothing. Like, if you wanted to poo, you had to just suck it up. Um, so we'd been tweeting at Money Ryan every day, just pictures of the toilet situation, pleading for help. Uh, because as we know, Money Ryan, he giveth, which we're very grateful for, but often he does ignoreth. Uh, and uh, for the most part, he completely ignored every single message, didn't respond to one of them. Except to point out that we'd been pissing on the floor. No, that was someone else <laughs> pointed that out. Not even he pointed that out. That was someone else in on Twitter. He he. I, I assume he noticed the piss, and he was like, "Well, I'm ignoring that. Yep. I'm not going to respond to that behaviour." Um, and that was your piss, if I remember correctly. Not my piss. I sit down to piss. That's uh, <laughs> okay. Well, maybe you should be using the women's bathroom <laughs> instead of the disabled bathroom. <laughs> Um, so we'd been, uh, I'd been tweeting at Ryan uh, and encouraging all of you guys to tag Ryan in the post and on the Instagram story, commenting on his social media, and he completely ignored all of it. It seems like no matter how often you ask, he still can ignore it. Um, but uh, we got in today after being away for an entire month, and I'm happy to report, guys, that after over a month of ignore thing, money Ryan giveth. So we haven't been at the studio for about a month and uh, Keelan went to the bathroom and immediately grabbed me and now we're filming this. So I assume something's happened in the bathroom. Let's have a look. Oh. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's disrespectful. I get, <laughs> I get three plies, Luke gets, I get, so I get three squares of toilet paper, Luke gets two and Ooh, you and Ruben are going to have to share one square. <laughs> and a tea towel. Oh, and a, <laughs> and a tea towel. Well, you know what? I can't complain, Ryan. He he didn't ignore it, and he has given it. I'm pretty happy with that. This has been there since the day after we left to go to Gold Coast. Oh. The Sunshine Coast. So it's been there for about a month. <laughs> So everyone else in the office has just been having to look at that. <laughs> <laughs> and they just can't touch it. <laughs> yeah, apparently. That's great. And the busiest toilet of the office as well. I, what I find really curious is how I got three squares of toilet paper, Luke got two, and then you and Ruben have to split one. Yeah. I understand giving the editors one to split. Very funny. <laughs> That's really funny because there's two of you and there's only one square. Yeah. Great joke. I don't understand why I get one more square of toilet paper than Luke. Is that a joke that I'm missing? Do they think I'm more important? Is it because I'm long? Perhaps you have a dirtier hole. <laughs> <laughs> I just give off dirty hole vibes. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'll have to ask Money Ryan. I mean, I won't get an answer, but I will ask. 